I can't stop now. I guess I'm finishing this. I'm finishing this tonight. Cause what the? I'm not stopping. Mark, are you awake yet? Breakfast wet, ready, sweetie. Come all's hot. Okay, mother. I will come and get the the uh the food. That's it. What the fuck? Um, keep going, okay? What the fuck's going on, Mark? The hell? Uh, I don't remember this hallway being this this long. You can do this. The fuck is this? Well, just playing in the background. I'm right here, sweetie. Planes, flowers. You have to work. To, you have work to do today, sweetie. Hop to it. out the picture again. He does it every time. Thanks for so much. From Parikov Borka. Dad. Happy New Year, Mark. Today's the club audition, right? Good luck, son. Make your mom proud. You can show her a video, maybe. I'm sure she'd love to see you play. You got this. Hmm. Send us money. Malcolm dead, son. Nice. Um, is there anything else? Nothing. I still have some time to squeeze in some practice. It's now or never. Dude, I'm so sketched out. Like, was she? Okay, here's, here's a theory. She, Nicole could have just been feeling like that. Oh, we met, I, the moment I met you, it was like already like, damn, I'm so comfortable already. Like, I, I feel like I could just talk to this person. But I don't think that's true because she was really fucking angry at, at us. So I think it must be the same deja vu nonsense. Dude, what the hell? Is it real or is it fake? Because I'm trying to I'm trying to think. Here's what I think. I think Mark's mom died in a plane crash. That's what they're hinting at the whole time, right? It's pretty obvious. And I'm wondering if he realized this because he's just kind of smart, right? And he realized that the plane that she was on was a uh, was I don't know maybe a victim of the ruling, and he realized that, and he just doesn't want to acknowledge it. And maybe that's also why he's not like he doesn't try in school or stuff because he's like, no, I don't think that's true. I don't know. I just feel like his mom is dead because also we got pictures. We got we have pictures and we have texts from dad. We don't have anything from mom. Right. Bruh. But that's the thing. The, the whole deja vu shit. Is that in... Because, okay. The plane... When we were... Oh my god. Whatever, dude. I'm... 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 I'm, I'm fucking... I'm sketching. I'm, I'm... I'm tweaking. I gotta... I gotta just calm down. Just look at this shit. I could use this. At least let me borrow it. She said it'll help me... Help me my tempo. How does this thing work again? I'm rewind something. Uh, 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 oh, that, and then, the fuck is this, oh, that changes the beast per second, then, hang on, maybe 100 beats per minute, and then think dark think dark think dark think dark that's gonna get annoying real quick let's see do i start with this exercise booklets booklets from from lease or should i jump straight to the wedding day uh progressive studies oh boy oh boy oh boy what riveting stuff huh happy birthday one of, their, one of the classics of all time. 
But this was not to be underestimated. Let's see. 85 beats per minute in 3-4. Oh, I see. Um, sure, practice it. Hang on. Oh, wait. Fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, no. <laughs> Hang on. It's, it's not it's not right. It's not right. It's for making progress, at least. Is Friday Night Funkin' now? Okay. I think I'm good, then. Honestly. I'm ready to roll. <sighs> oh, my back hurts. Fuck. There are a few sessions to do it. Or... Okay, one more time. Hang on. Okay, I got it now. Right. We're good to go. Let's get this. Let's get this shit done. I could do more, or you know what? Maybe I'm all good. Prep for school. Okay, this is it. This is what it all comes down to. You can do this. You, Karen. Did you guys hear about Jessica? What about her? <laughs> Nine Pearl. That's our. That's our stuff. Did you guys hear about Jessica? What about her? I saw that she went missing. Nook face. Oh, she's the one who was the artist, I think. Right. Please help. My daughter Jessica Basta has been missing since, since December 27 20, 26. What am I reading? 27th. She's 15 year old, 5'3 in height, small build. Whoa, what the hell? Huh. I trust that God will bring her back. Cool. Uh, damn, what the fuck? Holy shit. Has anyone heard from her? Not me. I don't know her. I don't really know her, to be honest. Uh, who's our friends here? Who's our friends here in our class? I don't think she had many. She didn't really talk to us much. I remember the one time we talked to her was so much. We were like, hey, nice, nice picture. Wow, what the fuck? Does she even have any? What the hell, dude? What? I think she likes to keep to herself. When was this? Before Christmas Eve, according to the post. That's sad. Damn, right before prom, dude. If anyone knows anything, do let her mom or the proper authorities know. Yes, ma'am. I hope she's okay. Recruit morning. Good morning, recruits. Today's a big day. Mom must be so scared. And yeah, right before prom, too. Did she have a date? I don't know. Hmm. Uh, good day. It's a big day. Don't disappoint us now. You've put in the hard work. Now, now all that's left is to show everyone. Her picture looks so cute. Hell yeah! You better pay special attention to my performance, okay? Thank you, Lise. I'll do my best. That's so, she's she does a little cute me smile. We've got this, guys. And I'm sure Nicole will blow us all away. Right, Nicole? She ain't around for some reason. Uh, she did apply, right? She did. She's probably asleep. <laughs> she didn't need as much practice after all. Well, that's right. That's right, hee hee, ha ha. <laughs> oh, to be a prodigal child. Child prodigy, I mean. I forget his voice. Well, we'll see you la all later. This is it. Today's the day. Nicole better have not gone missing. I'll be upset if Nicole is gone. That blurry ass picture. What the hell? Why can we never see what it is? 
They zoom in on it so many times. It's the third time, it feels like. Alright. Hey, guys. Whoa, who are these people? Wait, guys, get this. Are you a Fermata? Because I want to hold you. Sorry, dude, but you're not my type. Yo, Mark, Happy New Year! It's the big day, huh? How you feeling? As ready as I'll ever be. And I'm ready to take your breath away with this performance. Just you wait. Oh, I've been waiting, all right. For a while now, actually. <laughs> it's now or never, isn't it? She's graduating after this. This is my last chance to make an impression. Well, good luck with that. Hi, Samantha. Hey, Kathy's here. Morning, Sam. You ready for this? Mark! I, I think so. I really want to get this right. Practicing from sheet music, huh? You can read all that? N no, I just practice from video tutorials. But it's nice to look at, isn't it? I... I guess? Well, good luck, Sam. You've got this. Thanks, Mark. You too. Hello. She's so cute. Look at Kathy. Hmm. And who's putting a smile on your face? Oh, fuck. Damn it. It's nothing. It's just a, a funny 3D cat that says what I type. See? God. Hmm. Can you make it say, Jaggy's the best? Hmm. Meow. Good luck on your performance, Mark. <laughs> Thanks, Kath. I guess I better not disappoint. After all those mornings, coming into class with sleep dunk on your face because you stayed up all night practicing, you'll do fine. Hey, I did not have sleep dunk on my face. <laughs> hey, you got this. Aw. Kathy's such a good friend. You got a camera? To record everything? They said I should record my performance for mom. Is that a good idea? Am I good enough? Here they come. <sighs> Carlo looks like he has a stick up his ass 24-7. Welcome everyone to the 16th annual Lick Lick Auditions. We've seen you all work so hard and we're finally here. As you all know, Carlo and I are graduating this year. And it's our wish to see the club continue on with passionate people like you. No, don't leave! If you get in, that is. Never mind. Sam, you've gone just from admiring music theory finally playing music yourself. Justin, you've really put in the work and mastered your piece. That's right. Fur Elise. A classic. And Mark, you've really showed us how serious you are about this. Putting in the work with Nicole every day? Oh yeah, he put in the work with her all right. Oh, shut up. We're so proud of you. I'm confident you'll show us all how far you've come. I, I'm sure we're leaving the club in good hands. Take care of it, okay? Uh, I'm angry all the time. Um, before we start, let's begin with a quick roll call. Samantha Ann Garcia. Present. Justin Valencia. Right here, be Mark Borja. Here. And Nicole Lakasmana. Laksamana. Sorry. Where the fuck is she? I'm pissed. Where is she? I'm scared. Dude, where is she? Nicole? Uh-huh. She's not here yet. Dude, what's with that shading grin she has in the background? Uh, I'll message her. She, uh, likes to grab a bite at the canteen after dis dismissal. Oh, thank you, Mark. 
She can perform last then. So anyway, here at the rubi rub rubrics, she's still offline. Nicole, hey, are you on the way? We're about to start. Dude, where is she? And that's it. All right, everyone. Now, without further ado, let's begin the auditions. Good luck. You'll need it. Get it, Sam? <laughs> yeah! What the hell, dude? Sam's playing. She's doing pretty well. Dude, what the hell? Where is she? I'm scared. I'm worried. I'm like really worried. Dun, 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 dun. Psst, Mark! Look at Elise! It looks like she's starting to get it! Oh, she f no way she- no way she just now got it. No shot she wasn't just playing dumb the whole time. It's about damn time. <laughs> Dude, what's going on? I'm so worried. <laughs> that ain't me, I'm so cool. Mark, you're up next. Dude, what the hell? Bruh. Mark. Show him. Here we go, man. Wait. Sh should I send mom a video? Ask Kathy to, to make a video? Yes, of course. What? What's with the holdup? Don't let the nerves get the best of you, man. You can do this. Kat, could you take a video of my... Why, of course. Now go ahead and kick ass. Okay, fuck. You've got this, Mark. Okay. Oof, I'm actually, like, nervous. I'm actually really nervous. <laughs> <gasps> Is that her? Please. Yes! I'm sorry I'm late. You're just in time. <laughs> nice. Oh, I was so worried. I was extremely worried. What the hell? Lazy hands. Okay, posture. Lazy hands. Okay, posture. Don't let her down now. You can do this, Mark. Make mom proud. Okay. Oh, fuck. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm fucking up. Oh no. Okay, I'm getting everything else perfect.
computer can't handle this game apparently. Man, let him get into it. Feel it, Mark. an excuse there uh i used a technique before when i was practicing where uh well i'll explain later hell yeah <laughs> that's my best friend Woohoo! i knew you had it in you well done mark man there's no way you're not getting in this is it mark the sleeping genius in your knocking awakens <laughs> yeah he has no choice but all the noise you're making. Wait, what's that you have there? Duh, cookies. I meant that thing on your fi- Oh, this? Yeah, it's just a bike baking accident. See, I poured my blood, sweat, and tears into this. So you better like him. Or else. Or else what? Or else I'll eat them myself. Oh- you wouldn't dare. <laughs> you know I would. You're cruel. Um, alright everyone. Th thank you so much for attending the 16th annual IP L LIPC auditions. Mm -hmm. Um, th thank you everyone for your support. And applicants, congratulations on a job well done. Please wait to hear from us on your application status. Th thank you all again. Oh, wait, what? Did you, Nicole not... P please get home safely. The hell? Nicole? Ooh. I just don't get it. We already talked about this. I know. Did you just change your mind today? I'm trying to understand. It's... I'm sorry, Mark. I must be so mad. I'm not... Is it... I'm just confused. What's going on? Mark! I, I need a second to get my head straight on. On straight. I... Louise, you look a little bit rough. Why is your hair so messy? Mark, I've been looking for you. I have some concerning news. Is it urgent? Yes, it is urgent. Don't want to hear it. Hmm. We back in the room again? Yeah, we are. Whoa, what the fuck, dude? Um, Louise, are you good? This does not look, um... Louise. You must have heard about it, right? About what happened to our classmate? Yeah. Jessica. Dude, what the fuck? She's reported missing. What about it? 
I don't mean to be callous saying this, but her disappearance might be the final piece to the anomalies. What? Jessica, anomalies? That doesn't make sense. Mark, I'm afraid the memory anomalies are just one piece of the puzzle. Oh fuck, uh oh. She's lost it. The full picture is mu much bigger. The full picture? Like this pellet. Everything in the universe is described by waves. Rippling across space and time. These ripples, these waves, they give rise to existence of particles that make up everything. That make up the, these pellets. That make up me. That make up you. Everything. Like the air, you might not see these ripples. But they are all around us. So, these space-time ripples? They're basically how everything exists? Exactly. And it's not just that. These ripples meet and collide. And when they do, they interact. That's how particle interactions happen. Particle interactions? Oh, forgive my vocabulary. Here, observe. Did you see that? The pellet landed on the floor, so, uh... The pellet and the floor interacted. More specifically, the particles did. And that's because... Hmm... The space-time ripples of the pellet... And the space-time ripples of the floor... They collided. They interacted. Precisely. And that's how everything behaves and it works the way they do. Photosynthesis, our senses, electricity, and memories? Yes, everything. Including memories. If so, how could memories even, like, interact? Sure, sunlight and plants. But memories? Interacting? Right, particle interactions do have rules. And there's no way memories could possibly interact and get mixed up. Yet, they have. And if you think about it, there's no way natural disasters could happen all at once in 24 hours, if not by pure chance. And hey, there's no way that long, vivid time at the hospital could have been a hallucination. I guess? No, no, it definitely was. See? That's what I meant earlier. The full picture. You see, the quantum world obeys rules, unless the extreme happens. Whoa. Like a tsunami. These strong, violent ripples may have passed by us. And they rocked the planet's core, causing a string of natural disasters. A quantum tsunami. You could call it that. But what about the memory anomalies? It's the same. A quantum tsunami must have swept our minds. Our memories could have gotten mixed up with someone else's. So, my memories mixed up with Nicole's? And someone else's memories of the weather with mine. And everything inexplicable. Where do these quantum tsunamis come from, anyway? W well, I'm asking myself the same. I'm not sure on it yet. But look, these extreme quantum fluctuations, the quantum tsunamis, they might still be going on, and that leads me to... Jessica? Yes, because these ripples, they can cancel each other out and... Oh boy. When they do, that affected thing or being or person ceases to exist. Wait, hold on. Don't get me wrong, I respect all the time and effort you've put into this, but are you implying this isn't a problem of our minds? But instead of... Reality? Nah, oh boy. These two bitches. I hate them. You know what? You're right. Quantum mechanics isn't even supposed to work at a ma macroscopic scale. But here I am. Disappointing you and myself. Louise, hey. Maybe you just can accept that this is on us. 
I mean, look at me. Trying to keep up with all the expectations I set for myself. No, don't give up just yet. There has to be something we missed. I heard the start of the year will be rainy. And <laughs> maybe this time I'll be sure of it when it rains. When Jessica didn't come home, I remember Kathy and I were together that day and and it was raining. You never got to compete with that chess player from in Zero, right? Polly? Y yes, I won by default. After that day, oh shit. And it was raining. Right. After that day we watched your game. Was that the day she went missing? I that is what I heard, yes. Cuz the day after your game, Kathy and I were together at an Alpha Mart and it was raining too. The ruling had hurricanes and heavy rainstorms. When I hallucinated at the hospital, I heard rain and thunder outside. Rain. Rain. Quantum tsunami. It could be the source. I'm not saying it's true, since this could simply be a coincidence for all we know, but... Better safe than sorry? Look, I don't want to jump to conclusions just yet. Extreme quantum fluctuations caused by rain. Bizarre, but it might be worth studying. The ruling was already b bizarre to begin with. Well, whatever the case may be, there's nothing wrong with being careful. And you said it's gonna be ra rainy season, right? I, I have to think more about your hypo hypothesis. Hey, I. There's no rush. I have to get to the bottom of this. Aren't you going home yet? I'll manage. You need to talk to Nicole, right? Well, don't worry about me. And yes, about the raining. Be careful out there. Y you too. Thanks, Louise. Hey, take it easy, okay? Man. She... I don't even know. This could be all in their heads. And maybe, like, it's... Coincidence is doing what happened. I don't know. Fuck, this game is, like, making me question whether or not it's real or not. I don't know. Fuck. Well, whatever. Girlfriend time. Ooh, rain clouds? I owe you an explanation. Sympathetic. Uh. I mean, sympathetic. I'm, I'm assuming whatever it is, it must... Must not be fun for her. I'd appreciate that. I know I said I would join the club. See, I, I wanted to. At the time, at least. You must be so angry at me for all the confusion. Maybe. Maybe a little bit. I'm just frustrated. Please, talk to me. That's fair. For what it's worth, I'm so sorry, Mark. I didn't mean for all this to happen, but... Even today, sitting there and seeing... I, I mean, I just knew that... Joining the piano, piano club... It's not going to make a difference. Not really. What is that note she keeps on holding on to? I want to know what that is. Thank you, Nicole. Listen, I... I want to thank you, Nicole. I do my best practicing, but I only got this far because you helped me. I feel different now. Everything feels different. I feel like I'm more determined now. Like I found direction. I feel close to my mom. I feel like I can take on her dreams. Dreams that she set aside for me. You've helped me get there. And 
I can't thank you enough for it. I I just want to pay back the favor and help you the way you helped me. You put in the work, you know. I just helped you along. I'd like to help you along, too. At least, I'd like the chance to. What? Nothing. You're just so you. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> you're just as insufferable as the day you ran into me. <laughs> and you're just as stubborn. Really, though. Thank you. I don't know how I can repay you for this. My mom... I wish she were here to see it. Did you send her a video? Uh... I don't think I did. I... I don't think I was good enough. Maybe I shouldn't. Oh, don't be like that. She'll love it. My grandparents love recording all my recitals. It was kind of a tradition. Your grandparents? Yep, remember? I started to play because of them. Huh. I miss missing them. I really do. I haven't seen them since we had to leave a year ago. In the province? Yeah. And luckily, their area wasn't affected by the ruling. So they're safe and sound. But I still worry about them. Watch out for rain. At Notre Buena, you... You mentioned visiting them soon. I did. I'd, I'd be happy to go with you. You know, as a small gesture of thanks. You... You want to come with... With me? Y yeah. Your parents said you should bring a friend along. And I'd love to meet the people who taught you to play. You don't have to, you know. You don't owe me a thing. I even came here to apologize. I want to. I can see how much you miss them and... And how much they mean to you. It's the least I can do. You really mean all that, don't you? I do. We going on a road trip? Oh boy! Hmm. What the fuck was that? I hate this. Just a really long stretch of road. All straight. No sharp turns. Big, big, big. Quiet, son. How can she sleep like this? Is that gonna wake her up? Smell of food? <laughs> Screw this. Oh, it's her mom. Hi, Mark. Did you please tell Nicole to check my text? Hello, Mr. Lakasmana. Lakasmana. I always get the wrong first. I'm afraid she's taking her beauty nap. Should I wake her up? Pass sleep, you head. Did you two stay up all night texting again? <laughs> His face, he's so blushing. Just kidding. <laughs> Lamal, she knows how to use Lamal. Isn't that what kids say nowadays? Yes, but... but yes, but I don't know. I... That... I'm... <laughs> Oh my god. Anyway, once the CPI is awake, could you remind her her the remind her the directions? It's, it'd be best you know too. Pl uh, of course. So you're 
We're on a bus to Takei, right? Get off at Baras. There's a big welcome sign there. You know you're at the right place. Then get on the jeep to Paraiso. Paraiso. She'll know where to drop off from there. Got it. Braiso. Bara. Borais. Boraioso. Then Paraiso. Then Paraiso. You won't get lost. Now, haha. Tell her, okay? And, he, and kids, if you don't know where you are, just give me a call, alright? We will. Oh, and her grandparents will be so happy to see her again. Surprise them for me, okay? Uh. I'm excited to meet them. We will. I'm excited to meet the people who got her to love the piano. Oh, you're so sweet. Don't mind me. You go take a nap now. Have a safe trip. Thanks, Mr. Lakasmana. Lakasmana. Hey, Mark. So you finally decided to blah, blah, blah. Let me see. So you finally decided to elope, huh? How's the trip going? Uh, it's bad. It's been real bad. She'd been given the cold shoulder. <laughs> what? Yeah, we gotta fight. <laughs> Such a troll. What are you doing? I can't believe you. This is your first and last chance at love. I know. <laughs> what did you fight about? About who gets the window seat. Bruh. Yeah, we settled with rock paper scissors. It was a clean sweep. She's still bitter about it. I don't know why I believe everything you say. You believe everything you, re you read. Shut up. Sophia, huh? Hi. Yo, Marky. Hey, what's up? Oh my gosh, so many people texting me. We got so many girls on my on my dog, bro. Hmm? Shut up. You're going home tonight, right? Nothing. What the fuck? That's the plan. If you consider what the fuck? Oops, hang on. If but if you consider traffic, maybe we'd be home by then. By maybe we'd be home by maybe ten, give or take? Why? Great, so no sleeping over. You still have a pure heart. As you should. I'm going to heaven. What the fuck is this? Huh? Uh, what? No, it's really nothing. Don't worry about it. Hee <laughs> hee. The fuck? Speaking of nothing. Prom's a couple of nights away, isn't it? I'm getting a little all excited. Face it, Marky. You don't know nothing about fashion. That's not how you spell fashion. Wait, is it? Yeah, it is. I'm silly. Oh, wow. And what makes you say that? Come on, literal Greek branded suit. And you think you're funny? What? Where did you... How do you... How do you know that? How does she know that? You are Sophia and... Sophia and... Uh... Kathy getting together? Yo. Yo, I bet they're together right now. <laughs> That'd be crazy. I didn't say anything. I see I have a stalker here. What do you want from me? I want nothing from you, okay? I just want you to look decent for prom. And what's the catch? Oh my god, some people texting me, what the fuck? You give me what I want, you give me what I want. I make you not look big stupid. Bruh. A serious question. How do you figure out what a person likes? Uh, I don't know. You ask them? Without asking them. And who's them? Is it Sophia? I really hope. Um, let me rephrase. How do you figure out that Nic what Nicole likes? Oh, I see. Uh, just pay attention. Real. Real shit. I just paid attention. 
Hang on. Ryan. Dude, which one do you think looks cooler? Uh, why me? Scene. Okay. Uh, uh, hang on. Fuck, I'm like getting overwhelmed. I just paid attention. Things she mentioned, what makes her happy. <laughs> Looks like we got a real lover boy over here. But honestly, I don't think it e I even know what she likes the most. Then why don't you ask her? Well, why don't you do the same? Uh oh. Oops. Hey, <laughs> sly. Just gone with it. Is this for your your proposal? Gift to Jaggy? No. Uh, you just said you want nothing from me. Exactly. So? What the fuck? Dude, what? You give me what I want, I make you not look big stupid. Oh, yeah, I knew, I knew it. I knew it. I knew there was some stuff going on. They both touched me at the same time? There's something going on. They both just got done hanging out with each other or something. So yeah, best friend's kind of cool though. Riddell? Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? Why? Yeah. No, he's talking about the other one. I mean, no, the other one. Kathy? You only have two friends? <laughs> okay, just tell me what you want. I want you to tell me what Kathy likes. It's for a friend of a friend, actually. But you know, you tell me then, but you know, you tell me then, I tell them. Because, you know, I know them and, well, you don't. What? Forget it. Just meet me on Monday. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, yes, it's for my J-boy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, sure. Hold it, my J-boy? Yeah, Jaggy. Did you just say J-Boy yourself? Yeah, that's right, I did. I like him a lot. Oh, okay, you know that. I don't want to hide my true feelings now, you know? Uh-huh. So, what should I do, man? You're not afraid anymore, I guess, so don't hold it back. Just go talk to him. I guess the more you talk, the more you'll know about each other. And it'll come naturally? Really? I know it's not very helpful advice, but it is what it is. How you get to know someone. And I think I like that way. Like it that way. You might too. So we just have to talk. Pretty much. Man, if only you talked to me like this always. Sai would be in a much better shape. We probably have flying cars and shit by now. Flying shit? No, no. Damn it, Mark, I hate you. Flying shit. <laughs> Get away from me. You need a nap. Good luck with J-Boy, then. You need to with your honeymoon. Hmm, interesting. Please. Mark, are you there? I've got some news. You want to hear it ASAP. Uh, how are you? Louise, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. But look, you need to know this. I've studied it, and there's a way to stop this madness. At least one kind of madness. What do you mean? We hypothesize that when it rains, it causes a quantum... It causes a quantum tsunami, right? We can stop that? No, unfortunately. We can stop the rain or the quantum tsunami you could bring. We can't stop the rain or the quantum tsunami you could bring. But we can stop the one, th one thing for sure. Someone disappearing. Really? Don't get too excited, though. It's not like there's a switch we can flip that gets rid of it permanently. So, it's a temporary solution? It's a proactive solution. 
when it rains, a quantum tsunami could wipe something or someone's existence, right? But that will only occur if no one is observing them. Observing? What I mean is, if no one is looking at them. Hmm. If they're alone while it rains, the chances are very slim, but it's po it is possible that their existence gets wiped out. Was Jessica alone when she disappeared? I mean, she don't have any friends, so probably. Just like me, for real. Of course, I needed to verify that, and yes, that must be the case. Jessica always walked home from school at, at a new subdivision. There's, they're one of, a f well, they're one of the few families living there right now, sparsely populated. And Polly? She had a professional professional mentor that she went to every day after school, including the. The, that day after our quarterfinals. I was there, yeah. And on that day, her mentor was still not home. Was still home. Still not home. Stuck in traffic. She waited, alone in her mentor's house. And when her mentor arrived, she was nowhere to be seen. No way that, that can't be. You can doubt me now if you want to. It's normal. No, that's not what I mean. It's better to take it out. Take it as it is, either way, isn't it? That way you don't lose anything, or anyone. Hmm. Yeah. If you don't mind me asking, where are you right now? Uh, I'm on a bus on the way to Baros, 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 Baros. It's not what I'm saying, Baros. Are you serious? Why? Around there, that's where the, a ruling earthquake, earthquake hit. We don't know for sure, but it might be around hotspots of extreme quantum fluctuations. What are the chances? Low, perhaps, but still. It's way more than what we have here. Uh, well, what do I do? I can't possibly go home now. Do you have someone with you? I do, so I look after them. And they look after you. Please, especially when it rains there. Don't let each other out of your sight. Ever. Okay. It's scary, but okay. Okay. Uh, today. Last week. Wait, what the fuck? No rain. Was it not last week when it rained? Whoa! That legitimately scared me. For fuck's sakes, what are you on? You want us dead? You okay? Yeah. That really scared me, though. Your mom texted me. She texted you, too. But you were asleep. You got hiccups. She did? Oh, that must have been a good nap. <laughs> anyway... She just wants to make sure we don't get lost. She gave the directions again. Eh? As if I don't remember. Baros then Pareso. I'm butchering those names, but whatever. Easy as pie. She told me there's a... A big welcome sign, I know. Can't miss it. There's also a big book of pie there, too. Well, if that's still there. Whoa, there's like ruins outside. Uh-huh. That's my hometown, Mark. I know everything about it. Are you sure? You haven't forgotten? It's only been a year. Is this... the fault line they used to call home? It's worse than what I see on the news. Jesus, oh my god, what the hell? You hardly see this on the news. Look at her, please look at her, I'm, I'm afraid. <laughs> you can find some on social media, but they do their best to bury it. It's been a year after all. We want to put the past behind us. So now it's all about recovery. Resilience, happy faces. 
the ones that get the likes. Would you say you're lucky? We're just more fortunate than the rest. We told my parents we could buy this house. He told me I could transfer to the school. But that's only because we were on... on the second floor of the evacuation center. Oh. We also had a couple of dinners. But that's all we could do to help. When people get sick, we pray to God they have medicine and enough doctors. People died there. They didn't have life support. No hospitals, no highways. And even if they re they're rebuilt now, do they have anywhere to go to? They... I'm sorry, Mark. I guess you don't see the full picture. Unless you see it for yourself. Yeah. I see it better now. What about Jake? Oh! No, no, no. He went missing years before the ruling. I see. But what about his parents? His siblings? Do you know where they are? I... Hmm. It's okay. Sorry. You don't have to answer. Aww. Damn. She's had a rough life for sure. Come on, trust me. I'm pretty sure this isn't where we were supposed to get down. There should be a better route from here. Should be? Just help me ask around. Okay. The damn seagulls loud as hell, dog. Gotta poop on me. Better not poop on me. Damn seagull. Man, talking about some. Excuse me, what's the best way to get the parasol? Paradiso from right now? Paradiso? It's near enough. You can take a jeep from here. Or even a tricycle. If you pay a little extra. How much is a little extra? How much are you willing to pay? This isn't good. I should look around. Oh boy. 100 each. 10. 90. 15. Bye bye. Is it near enough to bike? Oh, uh, now I know what you you mean. Uh, now I know what you mean by a better route. Nice. Oh, that's gonna hurt your legs. Hey, doofus, keep your eyes on the road, or we'll, we'll crash. Well then, maybe you shouldn't be hogging it. Oh, we're not bringing this stuff up again, Buster. I stand by mine. You shouldn't have been blocking the entire hallway. Oh, real mature. Says the little missy who refused to talk to me in the principal's office. Hey, I absolutely loathed you that day. Can you believe how far we've come? What do you mean? Well, do you still love me now? Hmm. Well. Well? Hey. What's the matter, Slowpoke? Can't catch up? Maybe I just want to be a responsible biker. Oh, come on. It's not like it's a difficult road. All straight. No sharp turns, right? Well, I guess you're... Hey! Wait a minute! She was awake that whole time. I'm gonna get your ass, bitch. I'm gonna catch you up to you. Man, it's hard. Y you heard that? I heard what? Nicole! <laughs> I can't hear you! You're too far! Get the hell back here, girl. I'm gonna catch up to you. Come on, is that the best you can do? 
Yes, you wait. Uh, hell yeah. I don't wanna, 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 I'm worried. I don't wanna, I don't wanna get out of sight of her. I don't wanna, I don't, I don't wanna be let out of sight. Well, come down, come down, come down. Don't be so fast. I'm actually really worried. I don't wanna. No, 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 no. I don't wanna get out of sight of her. I'm worried. I'm actually worried. But I think the game wants me to. Okay, good. Oh. Film Cliff. I let you win this time. Don't want to accept the feat, huh? Just like you let me think you were asleep on the bus, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> hmm. Hey, wanna swing by for a bit? There's no way that'll hold. Hmm. Oh, ye of little faith. I'm worried. This is dangerous as well. <laughs> you doofus. Rude. Oh, come on, that was hilarious. Well, let's see if you can do it then. Step aside and watch a master at work. Hmm, give it a go then, Mr. Mister, Mister Master. Voila. Easy as pot. Master of stunts, I see. At least I stayed on longer than you. Come on, we can do this. Well, we've put in too much effort to give him now. <laughs> Aw. Whoa. These <laughs> goobers, dude. <laughs> So cute. Aha, uh -huh, I've done it. You? With a little help, I'll, I'll admit. <laughs> I did most of the work. I'm still worried about this. So, do you have a date for prom? You have a date for prom? Well, no one's asked me. Oh. oh. Can't miss it though, right? I mean, we were charged way too much for that. Yeah, I wouldn't want to miss it. Come sit next to me. Oh, uh, will it hold? Only one way to find out. The answer is yes. Huh. I guess our teamwork paid off. It hasn't let us down yet. <laughs> hey, Mark. Do you remember what I mentioned to you about the day we met? Y yeah. Did you feel something weird, too? Weird? No. In the moment, I was just furious. But later? Yeah, I think I realized... There was something mysterious about it. Oh, I... Oh. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Congratulations on the additions again, by the way. Not that I would have let a student of mine fail. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Like, I can't wait to learn more pieces like you. Like, I'm hopeful for what lies ahead. If that makes sense. I think it does. I'm really happy for you. What about you? I mean, how do you feel after everything? 
I I'm still a little unsure, I guess, about where to go from here. That's okay. That's okay. I felt really unsure too. But now, after the auditions, after working so hard with you, it's different now? Yeah. So it's okay if you're still unsure. We'll figure it out. We, oui, huh? Y yeah. I think we can take on anything. I want... I want to trust you. Me too. I want to really share with you how I feel. So you'd understand. Of course. I want you to understand... Oh fuck. Oh, the rain. Can I show you something? Um, sure. But maybe we should head out first? It's getting cold. And it looks like it's gonna rain soon. L let's take a short th shortcut through town. Will it take us there faster? Yeah, it should take us straight home. Mm. Oh boy, I'm worried. Oh, please don't have something tragic happen. I can't. Please, game, don't do this to me. Uh, please just let it all be in his head. Let it be in their heads. Let it be in their heads and there's no actual, like, quantum tsunami. That's, like, it must, it's ridiculous, right? It's not real. From rain? It's all just coincidence. Where are we? Hey, shouldn't we go back? This doesn't look safe. Just watch your step. We'll be fine. Is this the shortcut through town? Yes, it's the shortest path. How do you know that? Do you trust me? Of course. Uh, of course. It's just... I want you to understand... How I feel. Okay. I do understand. Come. I'll show you something. Wait, what about the bikes? It's a rough path from here on. We'll come back after. It won't be long. That's the way to your grandma's, right? Hey, wait! Follow me! Okay. Hey! Slow down! Oh no. Please come back into frame. Do not let it start raining right now. Wait! I can't- where is she? Shit, this isn't good. I have to find her before it rains. Oh, fuck. Church, broken down. Basketball hoop. Yo, Nicole, why are you an Olympic sprinter? Why have you- you just disappeared? Did you run away from me? I don't even wanna- I don't- Fuck it. Help us. This town. It's pretty, ba pretty badly hit. I don't think me looking at this will wear down on time or anything. Is this- I don't know what that is. What is that? Nicole? Hello? Congratulations. Is this where she used to live? Did she... But where else could she be? Oh my god, where is she? Nicole! What? Did we disappear? Damn it! Maybe just no connection out here. I'm so worried. What's that?
sounds like a Minecraft skeleton. Did you put enough torches down in this place? I think a skeleton spawned. Nicole! I've been looking for you! What are you doing in here? This house is one blow away from falling apart. Let's get out of here. Now. Do you really understand? I told you. I do. But can we please just talk about that later? When we're somewhere safer? But now, do you understand how I feel? About my past? I... But I... I thought I'd find you there at your old house, but... I don't get it. Where even are we? Jake's house. At least, it used to be. I thought... If I did one last visit, I'd find something here. Finding him would be wishful thinking. I thought maybe... He at least I'd find something. Something he might have left for me. It could be a note, or a gift, or anything he might have wanted to give me. But as you can see, there's nothing. I looked, but nothing was left behind. It's just a, a broken home. I, I thought we were going to your grandma's, right? Was, was that just an excuse? N no. I told you I want you to understand, and you agreed. So here it is. Now you know how I really feel. You didn't tell me it was about your past. Would you have refused if I told you? Of course not. But you didn't tell me, so I had no idea. You just left me back there, too. I thought you already knew it was about my past. How was I supposed to know? Okay, okay, that doesn't matter now. What matters is we know we're here for each other now, okay? What do you mean? We don't have to live like this anymore. We have each other now. Is this all you're here for? What? Whoa. I'm trying to open up to you. You could have explained. I thought you knew. Knew what? You never tell me anything. I excuse me? I don't? Now we're standing in a collapsing building for nothing. Whoa. For nothing? How could you say that? I, I know I shouldn't have, but but I just hope... Nicole, I... Can't you see how much this hurts me? Oh, fuck. Of course you don't. You have your best friend. You have so many friends around you. You didn't live through what we had to. You don't understand. N Nicole. See? I couldn't even help... But come here. I didn't really want to, but I I don't know. I'm a mess. Convincing, apologetic. Apologetic. It's not gonna work, but I, I'm sorry. I understand now. Stop. Just stop. How can you say that? You don't know what it's like. You have everything. You have what I can't have. I don't. I don't know why I expected you to understand. Damn. Zam. 
just say something? I shouldn't have snapped at her. What can I even say? I can't blame her for this, really. She's just holding on to something. Something already lost. Hi, Mark. Sorry, just checking in. Nicole hasn't been answering her phone. You two okay? Hey, is your phone on silent? Your mom's been calling. Oh boy. She's tired. Hi, Mr. Hi, Mrs. Laksamana. Sorry for the concern. We'll be home soon. She's we're it's been an entire day and she's just tired, I think. I'm very sorry we didn't message sooner. Alright, thank you, Mark. By the way, you should join us for dinner. I can pick you two up at the station. No, no thanks. Thank you, Mr. Lock Locksamana. I can't. I think I need... But maybe not today. I still have to... I still have some things to... To clear... To work on. Alright. Take care on the way home, okay? I wonder if she knows... How low she is, despite everything. But she's just holding on, telling herself there's still hope, lying to herself. That's what she was holding. We really make quite the pair, don't we? I thought things would be different now. I thought if I could just do one thing, find that spark. Was it real? I guess some of it was, but I can't, I can't keep pretending. I can't keep hiding behind one real thing. Damn, that's deep. Bursts of light in the dark. And now it's fizzling out. I'm moving, but going nowhere. No, not nowhere. I'm going all the way back. Back to where I started. The game started on a, on a train too. Well, not really. It started with them going to somewhere on a train. Going to school on a train. I mean, yup. It's dark now. I I want it to be over. Oh shit! Is he gonna be alone? He's he's he'll be alone. Nicole will be fine, but. Mark Mark doesn't have anybody to look at him during the rain. Oh fuck. Whoa. Wait, I'm a little I wanna wake up. Wake up. Wake up.
Oh my god, it's so much harder. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh my god, what the fuck? Yeah, <laughs> I can just fucking spam this, actually. Dude. I can just spam, actually. <laughs> oh my god, so hard. Bro. Are you okay, Mark? What the fuck? Yo, calm down. Calm down. Calm down, dude. Jesus Christ. Oh my. Oh my God, my hands hurt. Oh. Oh, okay. I've got in, I guess. Hello, Mark. Congratulations. You got into the club. Thanks, Elise. Man, it's so much harder now that we don't have a, a spark. I don't know if I can keep living in the dark like this, pretending. Aw. Uh, but I don't know if I can just wake up and face every day. Bruh. It's suffocating, like something closing in on me. I can't keep running away anymore. just holding on oh telling myself it isn't over wake up write this box i remember he was like nah it's just it's just nothing don't worry about it that there's still hope lying to myself he did understand her more than she even knew. Passport Rex. They really had to prepare, prepare for this. An empty passport ac application. A passport photocopy. Dad's? Mom's? I don't know. Photocopy of dad's passport, it faded. A photocopy of dad's passport, pa passport. Dad's passport, passport application. To whom it may concern, this is certified that I, the under, under, undersigned Dr. Joseph de Leon, examined Paolo H. Borja on March 15, 2007. The examination included that she is of sound mind and body to perform physically taxing work and other strenuous activities. Okay for work abroad. Signed, Joseph. Last name, first name, middle name, Borja, Paulo Hernan. Sexuality, M, Filipino, address, okay. Hmm. Dear Borja and family, we've received your inquiries regarding the status of this search for Maria. Oh, the search. Maria C. Borja, whom we confirmed before him to be a passenger of flight. Yeah. P1111. 
Unfortunately, we regret to inform you that there have been no I no le new leads in the investigation of the missing flight and all people on board the said flight. We would like to assure you that we are focusing all our efforts on finding answers for you and your loved one. And should there be any developments in the, in the case, we will contact you as soon as possible. Again, we would like to deeply apologize for the pain and grief this tragedy has caused. At Makabayan Airlines, we do not we do our best to ensure the safety and security of all our passengers. The freak typhoon was an accident we will not allow to happen again. We will hope to serve you again soon. Mabuhe Selma Rodriguez, Makaban Air Airlines. Oh man. Name Paulo H. Borja, electrician, United Arabs. Who makes CERN certify that that uh sound mine, yeah. Mar Maria C. Borja, domestic helper. Passport number. Date of birth. Chairman. Mission of elections. Mm. Still no sign of missing aircraft. On February 9th, 2014, flight P. 111 of Makibana Airlines went missing in a typhoon on a flight bound for Philippine International Airport. According to Felicity, Ra Felicity Ram Ram Ramos, a spokesperson from Makibana Airline, they are doing all they can to trace and locate the aircraft in question, but there have been no new leads on the investigation. We send our deepest compassions for the families of the missing passengers. Continued to Ramos. Continued Ramos. We are doing our best to answer your questions and hopefully find your loved ones. It had been raining on the day of the flight. But authorities had not expected the freak storm to grow to that strength and speed. Search and rescue teams, as well as concerned concerned volunteers, have been tirelessly leading their efforts to, to to the investigation. Dear Mr. Boria, with our deepest regret, we must inform you of our inability to spare any of our people for a special search and rescue team at the moment. Following the unexplained disastrous events on 12 February 2014. We've had our hands full at the moment, conducting rescue and relief operations in the affected areas. We send you our sincere sympathies regarding your missing loved one, Maria C. Borja. The pain of an unexplained aircraft disappearance must be un unfathomable, and we wish you the best of luck in your efforts. Peace, Philippine International Airport. M Mom. Wake up. Wake up, damn it. Mom, I'm so sorry. I want. I. <sighs> Hi, Mom. We had auditions for the piano club today. I practiced really hard for it, and I think I did well. I attached a video of my audition piece for you, just in case you want to watch it. I miss you. Mark. a draft he didn't send it yet i want to wake up oh my god oh my god mom dad and i really worried please get back to us as soon as you can this still hasn't been any update from the airline we, we call every day please just let us know you're okay mom please let dad know please let me and dad know you're safe you're really scared please respond as soon as possible Mom, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Please come back. I never even wanted you to leave in the first place. You didn't have to do that for me. I'm so sorry. I'll never ask for anything again. Please just come back. Please don't just leave me. Hi, Mom. I'm sending you another track email so you don't have to reply if you can, okay? Just, I'll just, I'll know if you open it. Miss you. Mom, it isn't fair. None of, of this is fair. The world is ending. You're not here. Hi, Mom. How have you been? It would mean a lot to me and Dad if you come come let us know you're okay and they're probably busy with work but the news really worried us and then all this other stuff happened with the earthquakes all over please let us know okay dear mom i'm sorry for everything i wish you and dad never left i understand why you did it i'm thankful for it but this isn't worth it i'm not worth it i can't eat i can't sleep i can't do anything dad is hysterical we really miss you please let us know you're okay please come home mom i promise i'll never ask for anything again i'll work harder in school i'll do anything just please come back Please come back. Hi, Mom. I miss you. 
I miss hearing from you. It's been eight months now. I don't know what else to say. I hope you're taking care of yourself wherever you are. Maybe you're playing the piano somewhere. Maybe you're still working too much. Probably that. Dan and I are always waiting for you, so don't be afraid to reach out, okay? We're not mad, I promise. You just want to hear back from you. I really miss you, Mom. Love, Mark. <sighs> Your mom. I got to talk to Dad on the phone today. He says work has been really busy. Looks like he's going to get busier. I hope he gets rested. He gets a rest day soon. He always sounds tired when I see him. Make sure to tell him I get less of rest, okay? Hope you're doing okay, too. I hope working abroad is really different. I know working abroad is really different and demanding. I hope your boss gives you enough breaks and days off. It'd be really nice if you both come home. I'm going to try out for the piano club. Yeah, I've been practicing Greek's wending day. And I'm totally a little less terrible than I was before. So I'll come home soon, okay? I really want you to see it. I promise I won't let you down. So many drafts. <sighs> oh, Kathy. <laughs> oh! Look who came around and brought the greatest cookies ever. Mark? Aw. Fuck, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> what? What's wrong? I, I'm a liar, Kath. Hey now. You can tell me about it. I'm here. Fuck. Oh my god, dude. Do you remember last year when mom was supposed to come home? Hmm? Remember last year when mom was supposed to come home? Oh man. Yeah, we were so excited. Is this good enough? Do you think we should do more? What about glitter? I think this is fine. Anything more would be too much. You playing yet another obscure indie song is too much. Oh, and what, what would you suggest? Some soulless radio pop drivel? You know it, baby! <laughs> Look at her go. Hmm, let's see. Fuck, this is such emotional whiplash. Oh my god. Yeah, get it, girl! Shit! Thanks for helping me clean this, you guys. I can't wait to hear her play again. I can't wait to hear actual good music, and I can't wait to hear actual good music again. You and me both. Oh, just admit it's good. I like it. I like it. They're haters, Catherine. Don't mind them. Mom will love these new embroidery kits. You better tell her I, I'll pick those colors out. Wait, which one is this? John? Joe? Um... She'll whoop you back in the shape in no time, Jobbert. Maybe Riddell's coffee will help. We're not pouring coffee into a plant. Besides, I need it if I want to finish that pitch and I've been working on. How's it going for you, anyway? Still ironing out the details, but it's getting there. Come on, what's it about? <laughs> we'll see. We're like, see nothing. I love... She's so... She's my everything. Are you pretending that Brune is a certain basketball play? Hey! You want a piece of this? I surrender. 
<laughs> Thanks again, you guys. Even though I had to endure your bickering, I have to admit, this place looks good. Ah, shucks. Can't you make me blush? Wait, I can take your homecoming pictures. It won't be free, though. What? My talent doesn't come cheap. No, no need, guys. I might we'll take a photo of the moment. It's free, too. Whoa, your brain works. Whatever. Now scram. I have to finish up. When you guys left, I could barely contain my incite excitement. But all I could do was wait. It had been two years since I last saw her. The house had been renovated since then, with new rooms and more space. But it just felt empty. It's raining. It was a storm that day. Right. It was a strong one, too. Yeah, everything got dark. This doesn't seem too long ago. Mark, are, are you okay? Listen, it's about your mom. The plane, they're trying to locate. But the storm is messing up any attempt to contact. I'm fine. So, I'm fine. So, okay. I couldn't. I don't. Mark, it's okay. I think I'm. I'm starting to understand. Damn. So on the way back. Fuck. Our plane went, went missing on the way back. Damn. Whoa. Dude, what the fuck? I'm scared. Dad got scared by what happened. He canceled his flight. But Dad and I, we've followed the news endlessly for days. We refused to give up. We knew that until the plane was found, anything was possible. We kept trying to reach her. We knew she had to be out there somewhere. But then... everything in one day. All search and rescue efforts were re redirected for victims of the unexplained earthquakes, tornadoes, and tsunamis. And just like that, everything forgot about that one missing flight. They called the ruling the end of the world. But the worst part was... It wasn't. The world kept moving on around me. And I couldn't stop it. Dad and I, we kept trying. Making calls, asking authorities, asking families of fellow pa passengers.
following the news, asking for updates. We didn't stop. We kept believing she was still out there. But at some point, I don't know if we were hopeful or just stubborn, pretending. We refused to admit it. We held on so tightly. Until all the gaps and cracks were covered. to fall apart. I lied to everyone. Even my best friends thought mom's flight had been cancelled in relation to the blue link. I started playing mom's piano, thinking it would solve everything. I think it would make it feel like she was here. I just kept lying and lying. I don't know how long I would have kept this up. Maybe forever. But then I met you. You were annoying and bossy and always looking for a fight, but I was too. You made me laugh, and I tried to make you laugh too. You made things bright again, and you made me want to look forward every day. Do better. To change. And I thought, we well, almost understood each other. But here we are, both holding on to something. Stuck in our yearning. Hiding. I don't want that anymore. I want to move forward. I don't know how to do that yet, but I know that holding on to something that's broken isn't going to help. I'll make it up to you, Nicole. I'll make it up to everyone. I've been selfish and naive, but now I can't lie to you anymore. I can't lie to me anymore. I want to stand you better and to be understood. Oh, Mark! What a pleasant surprise! I'll call Nicole down for you. No need, Mr. Lakasmana. Laksamana. Sorry. I'm just here to drop something off for her. Is that so? Is everything okay with you two? Uh... I'll be honest. Well... We haven't talked much since we came back from the trip. But I want to change that. In that case, I'll make sure she gets these. Thanks, Miss, Mr. Laksamana. Mrs. Sorry, did I call you Mr.? Oh, sorry. I should probably go. There's still a lot for me to do. Alright. Take care on the way home, you hear? Yes, Mr. Laksamana. Mrs. And Mark? You let us know if we can do anything, okay? It's always easier to do something with a little help. I'll... I'll keep that in mind. Damn, dude. I had a feeling that was gonna be... Whoa, you look dapper, my guy! Yeah, I just got here. It's actually pretty nice. Well, it should, it should, consider we'll be paid. Are you on the way? Easy, Mark. It's just prom. She's gonna be here. No, it's kinda like, sheesh, rainy. Uh-oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm tiny bit worried. Little bit worried. Today it's raining. Oh, I'm just 
just a little bit stressed out about that, but that's fine. Don't worry about it. It's just raining. Don't worry. The person just disappears. Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> nice! Her parents are driving. She won't be she won't be alone. Something wrong with the sky, Marky? Oh. I'm just a bit worried about the rain. It's a big night after all. It should be alright tonight, Mark. We're all in one place. Jeez, what a rain will a rain shop kill you guys? It's a big old roof. And who knows? A little rain could even be romantic. Got someone in mind? I, I mean for you. And I must say, you look great in your ensemble. You'll definitely catch your attention. And that that's thanks to you. Anyway, Mark, don't worry too much. Let's just... It'll be fine. Guys, hey, come down. It's prom night. We've got each other's backs, right? Let's just have fun. Alright. You right. Chill. So, uh, where's Mike? Oh, he came early. He volunteered to help set up the sound system. That's nice of him. Yeah, he... Well, well, well. Isn't that juicy? Oh my god, these two... I hate these women. Did they come here together? Looks like it, little miss... Looks like little miss goody two-shoes is turning over a new leaf. Girl, does that mean, like, Mike's single? Shut up. I'd ditch my date right now. Hey, hold on. I just have to practice my opening remarks. Uh, aren't we going to look for Mike? I'll find him in a bit. Oh shit, it's Mike. Uh-oh. Don't worry about me. Louise. Mark, just give me space. For once. I'm sorry. What the fuck do you mean give you space for once? The hell? You're always you're the one coming to me like I got a new fucking conspiracy theory. Listen, this is actually just waves, the quantum waves and the particles are actually just upon us, Mark. I mean Nicole's already here somewhere. I mean I don't I don't love Louise. She's kinda of annoying. Um Yo! Hello, Hermes, my guy. Dude, I thought she was gonna suck ass. But we somehow got our money's worth. I hear the, I hear they've even got fireworks later. We paid about 100, 850 for this. Nah, I got here for free. Varsity privileges, baby. Oh. Anyway, what's up, dude? Looking for your date, huh? Uh, have you seen these two girls? Seen Nicole? Yeah, have you seen her? Sorry, dude, I haven't really. I've just been waiting for for my here for my teammates. Ah, no problem. What about your day? The only date I know is March 7th. From Star Rail, Honkai Star Rail. The date of our next match. Right. Okay. <laughs> this looks nice. Oh, they went together. Fuck. Rip, Dustin. Did they go together or did they just here together? Mark, you're looking dashing tonight. Mark. Haha, <laughs> thanks. Have you guys seen the glow around? Oh, I'm afraid we haven't. Paul and I have been pretty busy preparing for our performance. We're just waiting for his sister to bring a new power, power brick. The other one died just now. <laughs> Unforgivable. Wait, what performance? We'll be playing a ballad for the slow dance tonight. So you better find Nicole before then. Such a shame about her choice for the club. Kinda like that shouldn't go to waste. I'm sure she has her reasons. I'll let you two get back to it. Good luck. I'm just staying, staying the premises tonight. You're being extra strict about safety. Is she still missing? Yes, still no leads. I, I heard, yeah. Anyway, thanks guys. Yo, Justin, my guy, looking good. Justin. Yo, Mark, didn't see you there. Taking a look. There's no way you can, you're can. you an actual DJ. What the hell is that costume? Hey, don't understand my DJ Larry. More like DJ Stalker. <laughs> hey, now, I'm just here to make sure you guys have a good time. Okay, okay. I might have slipped a fur at least for mixing this in the set list. You know what? Consider my curiosity peak. Hey, guys. Oh, it's Mark and, uh... Mark, what's up? Wait, not Mark, um... What's this guy's name again? Ed? <laughs> I forget. Mark, what's up? Hey, Mike. Mike, that's right. 
practicing for your performance? That's right, after I came this thing. Seen Louise around? She's practicing too. There by the she's practicing too, there by the entrance. Uh some mean girls. Oh yeah, don't. I think she's a little on edge. Just some mean girls, you know. Who the heck What? Thanks for the heads up, man. I'll have to do her in a sec. In a sec? What the fuck, dude? Be a good boyfriend. Cheer her up. Uh Whoa, that was a Good evening, good gods, goddesses, and mythical beings of Lamb Sun. Oh, that's not that's not Justin. Allow me to welcome you to JS Prom 2015, a night on Olympus. Students, please line up in pairs as we embark on the night, a night of heroes and romance. <laughs> oh, look look at us. Hmm. Look less horrible tonight. Coming from you? I don't. I'm, her voice is mixing with Justin. That must mean it, I really do look like a Greek goddess. Or a mythical beast. Uh huh. Where's the cold? Have you guys talked yet? No, but I plan on sending everything right tonight. Atta boy. Also, hey, did you hear? Finally, we get to watch one. We'll have a firework show at the end. Like, are we seriously getting our money's worth? From this school? Hold it right there. You never know until you try the food. Oh yeah. So someone gets salmonella. But if I were show, sure does sound romantic. So, you know, where's Jaggy? To be honest with you, I think I found a new crush. Besides, everyone knows by now that Jaggy likes boys. Whoa, huh, good for him. Come on, let's sign up. She'll be here. You're right. I'm just nervous. You got this, man. I'm rooting for you. Hey, stay close tonight, will you? Don't go out of sight. Yeah, yeah. I'll be right here if you need an emergency bailout. Y yeah. Thanks, Kev. On one condition. Can you promise to save your last dance for me? I've... I've got some things to tell you. Ooh. Important things. You? My last dance? You're not gonna confess to me now, are you? In your dreams... Angel, Navia, and what about that? Your face, your outfit... Everything about you disgusts me. Ugh. This outfit? This was Sophia's idea. So technically, you just roasted her. Oh, I mean, it's amazing. Yeah, she likes she likes Sophia. Of course, it was Sophia's idea. You have no fashion sense whatsoever. Mark Borja and Captain Joyce Portillo. You like her, don't you? What? I. Ah, oh, you got me. I knew it. Is that what you were gonna tell me? No, it's. It's much more important than that. Can you tell me now? Um. Oop. Too much going on. We'll talk later. She looks so cute in that butterfly dress. Remember our last dance, okay? Yes, princess. Ha <laughs> ha! That face! <laughs> She's the best. Oh my god. Yo! Get it, bro! Hell yeah! <laughs> oh, he's setting them up. Oh, I love this. Whoa, dude. Is that? There she is. Ooh. <laughs> That's Nicole. Damn, that haircut, though. Go on, ask her to dance. And we're basketball lingo for me. Just gotta do it. Alright, let's get it. Time to nut up. Oh, that's her, there. I didn't even notice her. Uh, hey. Whoa, let's go, dude. Hi. Shh. Can we talk? Actually, fuck. May I have this dance? I was wondering if I could have this dance. 
Yeah, I get it, bro. Y yes. Bro, take off your riz limiters. Go all out, just this once. Listen, I read your letter. I... I'm really sorry. About your mom. I didn't... I really didn't know. Of course you didn't. I didn't tell you. I'm sorry, Mark. I... I envied you. I thought... There was no way you could understand how I felt. I... I'm so sorry. I can't imagine how that must have felt been for you. You were right. Uh, about the piano club. I was so sure that it was the answer to all my problems. That suddenly everything would be better. I mean, I'm glad I met my new friends. I'm glad I learned how to play, play better. I'm still really thankful for, for you for that. But I was just using it all. As an escape from the truth. You knew that. I guess I remembered you too. I'm sorry. For thinking I could make everything better. That I could fix things and fix you just like that. I don't know why you put up with it. With me. With all the times I changed my mind and blocked you out instead of just talking to you. I'm so sorry, Mark. Especially for bringing you to the house and for what happened there. For what I did. I immediately regretted it. I understand why you were so angry. You must hate me. I don't. I don't hate you at all. I, I pushed you. I was selfish. I was hurt and I hurt you. You have every reason to hate me. I don't. But I don't. Please don't think that. I think we're both just trying. I'm so sorry, Mark. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, too. I guess we just have to keep trying. We'll figure it out. Together. Our teamwork hasn't let us down yet, right? Tell me about him. Him? Jake, I mean. If you don't mind. I, I don't mind. Jake was so happy when we were together. Always smiling and laughing and full of hope. And actually, I got the thing about finding a spark from him. I didn't really see anything past all the smiles and laughter. But now looking back, he'd never just leave. With no explanation. I just wish I asked. I wish I'd talked to him more about what he was going through. I just wish she told me. Is that why you wanted to go back? Yes. I thought maybe... Maybe he left something behind. Some kind of clue or message or sign. Nicole, you can't blame yourself for not knowing. You were so young. I, I just wish I did more. But Mark... You have so many great friends who really care about you. Promise me you'll take care of them. I promise. And Nicole? Promise me you'll look after your mom? I promise. Aww. So sweet. Let's... Let's promise to look after each other, too. E yeah. The rain's getting louder. I'm stressing. But maybe... In a special way? W what do you mean? <gasps> yes! <laughs> like that. I yeah. Like that. Nice, dude. I'm a little bit stressed because there's very loud rain in my ears. Drowning out everything else.
Look, let's talk more later. If that's okay. I promise Kathy a dance. Dude, what's going on? Is this rain supposed to be this loud? Okay, I'll see you later. Tell her hi for me. I will. There's something wrong. It can't be this loud, right? Hang on. Is the music just really... Hang on. No. What the fuck? That's so weird. Oh man, I'm stressing. I, I can't believe that just happened. I have got to tell Kat. It was good. I saw that, Mark. <laughs> Real smooth. And what about you? You can barely make any moves right now. The moment I was done DJing, they swing into action. The love is patient. I'll make her my last dance. Sounds like a plan. Where's Kathy? Oh, that's Nicole. I'll talk to her again, sure. We'll talk later. Hello? Mike? Sorry, Mike. Have you seen Kathy? Oh, Kathy? I think I saw her... She was dancing with Ryan, I think. Maybe he knows. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Does anybody have eyes on Kathy? Did she go to the bathroom or something? I will be very upset if Kathy disappears. I will be actually livid if Kathy disappears. If Kathy disappears, I will hate this world forever and I will rebuke thee, dude. Have you guys seen Kathy? Not since we last danced. Same here. I think she went to talk to her parents after our, our dance. Mark. I know, I know. But she must be here somewhere. I keep looking. Oh, fuck. Dude. Mark. I know, I know. I keep looking. Fuck, dude. Hey, speaking of last dance, have you seen Kathy around? I promised her my last dance. I did. Last I saw her, she was dancing with this pink oversized dress girl. Found her yet? Still looking. Dude. I swear. Excuse me. Mark, we'll talk later after prom, okay? I know, sorry, but have you seen Kathy? Since her dance? No, not really. Bro, need luck? Bro, bro, bro. Oh my god. Found it yet? Mark, I know, I know. But she must be around here somewhere. Keep looking. Dude, don't do this to me. Do not do this to me. Where is she? Is something wrong? No, everything's fine. I'm sure she's here somewhere. I can check the girl's restroom if you want. Yeah, please. I'll have them there in a bit. Can you go now? In a minute. No, can you go now? Can you go right now? Like, right now? Right now? Why in a minute? Found it yet? No. Dude. Dude, we... Paging Catherine Joyce Portillo. Paging Catherine Joyce Portillo. You're needed on the side of the stage now. Oh my god, what? She's... She's not with them? Will you help me find her? I just want to make sure she's okay. Should we head out and check? Let's go. Oh, bro. She's not even with her parents? Well, I mean, that's actually... That makes me more... Um... Less worried, actually. Where are you all going? We're heading out. Still can't find her? Alright, give me a minute and I'll ask around. Thanks, Mike. 
Bro, Kathy, you better not be missing. Please don't just disappear forever. I'll be so sad. You're one of my favorite characters. Damn it. I see security at the school. Find the right timing and sneak in. Kathy. Let's go the other way. Dude. Oh, butterfly. Th that thing. This is Kathy's. She must have gone outside. Mark? I, I told her to stay close. I don't know why she... Mark, we have to find her. The rain, it's... You're right. We have to find her before the rain stops. But we have to stay... M Mark, wait! Mark, hey, no one's in the restroom. W where is he going? Oh, fuck. Bro. I have to find her. That's hers. She went this way. Huh? Which way should I go? Either will take me to the highway, but... Danger. No trespassing. Guess this way. Mark. Mom? What? Keep going, Mark. Okay, Mom. Okay. Mom, is that you? No, I have to find Kathy. No. In the area. Ooh. I can't- I can't lose her. Mark, you can do this. Don't stop now. Keep going. N no, I have to save her. Kathy! Whoa. Mom? Mark, she needs you. Are you there? You have to save her. Don't leave me now! Go this way. You have to let go. Mom? You have to save her. Mark. Mom? You're almost there, Mark. You can do this. Almost there. You can do this, okay? Say it to yourself. Mom? Mom! 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 Do you remember that bowl of champardo you I made you? It was that day you woke up feeling happy. Because there were no classes, to your surprise. S sorry you didn't get to eat it. Er, you felt really bad it spoiled and had to throw it away. I did? You kept telling me for weeks you still felt bad about it. Like you had lost a pet. I, I was a kid. You kept blaming yourself for it, but son, I realized it just now. It's not your fault, really. It's not. I kept you too busy doing something I wanted you to, that I completely forgot you hadn't eaten yet. What? You don't have to- you don't have to explain, Mom. It doesn't matter now. We need to save her, now! 
Mom. There are some things you'll never get to know. And sometimes... You don't need to be so too hard on yourself. What are you saying, Mom? I... I... Now go, Mark. You're almost there. Mom, don't. Don't leave me alone. Mom! Damn. He's all fucked up. No, I, I have to. No! No! No, no! Fuck's sake. I don't have any other choice. No. <gasps> oh my god. Hey! Kath! You came all this way for me? For your last dance? What are you doing out here? I- I can explain. I'll tell you everything. I should've seen it coming. It's only at that point everything fell into place. Stop. Am I too late? The last time we played that racing game. Did I really win that match? Have I ever won? I didn't quite pick up what she said that day. Something like, oh my god, she's got like cigarette burns on her on her on her arms. She wants to be a racer or a sprinter. Was I paying enough attention? She once told me about butterflies in the rain. She said... They tatter. Or even... Mark? Mark! Dude. What happened? Fuck off. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Doing okay, son. I'm... I don't know. I... 
You can talk to us. Your, mon your mom and I will help you through this. Mom? M mom? You really bringing up mom? Mark? Dad, I can't. We can't keep. Son? We can't keep ignoring it. We need to talk. Okay. We'll, we'll talk later. Thank you, Dad. My stomach is in knots right now. Hey, dude. Is that your dad? Yeah, you got a chance to take some time off. That's good. So, how are you holding up? Been better. Yeah, I know. It... It doesn't feel real. I'm really sorry, Mark. Yeah. Me too. Mark, I'm so sorry for your loss. Fuck, I see your fucking picture. Oh my god. I was like, maybe it was not her. Maybe it's not her. Maybe she didn't die. I'm also sorry for being wrong. No, Louise. We both... We both had other things going on. We did. I just feel somewhat responsible. You were pushing me so much, Louise. I... It really frazzled me. And I wanted so badly for things to make sense. But it... It wasn't the rain. It was never about the rain. No. It wasn't. Was it... Really just all in our heads then? Everything? Everything we were seeing and... Dealing with? I... I don't know, Mark. I don't know how to make sense of it anymore. I don't think I ever did. Thank you, Louise. For everything. Okay. I'm not okay right now. Hey, Sophia. Hey. How are you doing? Um, I don't know. Not good, but... <laughs> Granny woke up. A beat. No way. That's great news. It is. I'm so glad I, to get to talk to her again. To hear her say something back. I'm happy for you. Yeah. I got to talk to Louise, too, a little bit. Things are okay. But it's not... Yeah. I know what you mean. I hope you're okay, Mark. Y you too, Sophia. Oh, Mark. I'm so sorry. Y yeah. I don't even know exactly what you're going through. I didn't know her like you did. But I... I felt lost. And it never feels any different. Or any better. I'm so sorry, Mark. Are you gonna be okay? I... I don't know. I don't know. I'm here, Mark. Thank you for running after me that night. You didn't have to, but... I'm glad I wasn't alone. Of course. You're not alone, okay? <sighs> I can't yet. I can't look at it yet. Oh, fuck's sake. Fuck's sake!
Why? Shitty fucking parents drive her away and made her fucking run out into the rain because they're fucking awful and she was afraid of them. Fuck. Did any of you really know her? Did I? I I'm so sorry for your loss. She was my best friend. Your Mark? Mark Boria? Yes, ma'am. I see. Mom, don't. What? Nothing. Sorry. For what it's worth, Mark. Thank you. We just wanted her safe. Too late for that now. Sh fucking pieces of shit. By the way, this was found like Kathy. It's for you. Oh, fuck. I remember. She she finally got it right. Music I actually like. She must have resealed this. There's even a weird burn on it. Classic Kathy. Loving thoughts are with you in this difficult time. From Tito Boy and Tito Baby. Our deepest souls is for your loss. Love the Salva Cruz family. Sympathy for your loss. May the love of, love of those around you help you in these difficult times. The Amsterdam School Integrated. I'm not okay. I'm not okay. I'm not okay, dude. I'm not okay. I'm fucking pissed. <sighs> Mark, I... Congratulations on the film. Uh, I'm still having that private screening. If you want to come. Just us. Y yeah. I'll be there. W we'll talk then. Sure. For the record, I... I'm sorry. Kathy, I, I wish... I wish we had that last dance. I wish I did better. I wish I could have saved you. I... I don't know... what I wish I did. I just wish you were here. I wish you were here, Kath. Fuck! Oh my god! This can't be how this game ends. There has to be another ending, right? This has to be a happy ending, right? It doesn't feel right without her. I wanted her to see this. You weren't even there. You weren't even around this year. I was busy working on this. For what? For you guys. For us? You couldn't even text us at Christmas. I was... You were busy too, but I was around. Was it enough? No. None of it was. Y you're right. I'm sorry, Mark. I'm sorry.
I'm sorry too. Me too. I'm I'm still so fucked up about this dude. What the fuck? I'm so pissed. Hi sir, good afternoon. I'm finishing up right now. Yes, no worries. On that end and Ah, Bonifacio may be home. But I think it's just about time for a change of scenery. Thank you so much again for this opportunity. Thank you so much, sir. I'll see you there soon. Oh. Who the fuck? <laughs> now, what do we have here? Man. How old is he now? How many years has it been? Nine? Ten? Damn, so he's like, what? He's 15... So he's about 25, 24. It's my age. I don't remember now. I'm getting old. I miss being called Marky and Dingleberry. I kind of like that too. No one calls me that anymore. Hope they're doing well. They'll always be the goofiest friend I had. There's still so much we don't know from back then. Their disappearances just stopped and everything went back to normal. And I guess life just went on. Got these last gifts. What was the occasion even? It wasn't my birthday. Maybe it's a belated Christmas gift? And I, I never opened it. Oh well. It should bring back memories. Wait, there was more. Whatever. Hey! Wow. Audio fog quality. How little this is the, the, this past QA. Okay. I'm so Who the fuck is doing that? Uh, why is there a guy just going ow in the background? Is that what they do in the Philippines? <laughs> the fuck? <sighs> Let me just. I just need to. Oh my god. Okay. I'm so fucking sad. What the fuck? What does she even want to tell us? Did she want to tell us that she was being abused? What a fucked up family. What a fucked up family for such a great person. Untitled. Huh. Oh. Hello? Mike Cass123. <laughs> Kathy? Alright. Looks like he's recording. Oh, Mark. Here's a bonus track from yours, your favorite best friend ever. Okay, you might have noticed it already, but yes. I downloaded the songs from LimeWire. The quality's shit, I know. And now I have butterflies all, all over my screen. Look, it was sold out everywhere, okay? I had to ask Mike for an extra sleeve. Anyway, I'm recording this here because uh, I might be too chicken to tell you at prom. The last dance. Uh, uh, seriously though. I don't really know where to start. 
but you opened up to me that night, and that was hard. And now, because of you, I... I feel like I want to do the same, and tell you the truth. Things are rough at home. Okay, yeah. Catherine! Come down here now! My parents are really strict and angry, and I'm not good. Not good enough for them. They, they always have been, um, I didn't know how to tell you. I tried, I tried so hard to get away from it. To stay home less and spend more time with you guys, but it's hard, Mark. And you, humor all got busy this year. Which is fine, it's great. You both found something you love doing. Honestly, I was jealous at first. I felt a little left behind. I was afraid of losing Riddell and, and I thought if I lost you too, I, I don't know. At one point, I was even wishing that you would fail. But that didn't feel right. I felt sick and guilty. But Mark, when I saw the passion sh shining in your eyes, I, I knew I couldn't take that away from you. I knew I had to deal with I knew I had to deal with my own selfishness. You guys worked so hard and I I wanted to shine too. You guys you inspired me. Yeah, yeah, I'm going soft on you. Yuck. <laughs> but now... That's how they met. I want to run. Like you. So cute. I want to do something I love. <laughs> I want to work hard for it. Fuck, that's so cute. They would have been a good couple. I want to live my life. I want you to see my eyes shine too. Even though it's hard, I'll fuck her parents. Even though my parents don't want me. Dude, what the fuck was that thing? She had like a device to like... Is that what they use on her arms? I want to run with you guys. Us, all together. run as fast as I can. Into the light. I want to be happy. I want us to be happy. So let's all run into a bright future together, okay? How bright, you ask? We'll go so far with all our friends. I bet Ryan's gonna be going to be a big basketball star. And finally, be the MVP.
or not. Sophia and her granny will be happy together? She'll wake up soon for sure. I've heard good things from Sophia. And oh, Riddle's movies? <laughs> we'll be walking on the red carpet every premiere night. Even if we're not part of the cast. We'll crash the place. Louise is definitely going to be so successful with the, with Mike next to her. They're going to be a power duo. And then I see you and Nicole becoming huge piano stars together. She better invite me to all your performances or else. And me? Who knows? Maybe this baking thing will take off. Or maybe I'll discover something else. We'll see. Well, whatever that might be. I don't want to be left behind now. So I'll run. With you guys. I I'm going to join you there. In the light. We'll do this together, okay? Until then... Uh, how do I stop this? Stop button, stop button. I can't find it. <sighs> Sorry, give me a minute. It's not fair. So not fair. Kathy. Barely see ahead. Is she first already? She is. <sighs> she was the first one to go. She said she wanted to be. Good at this. Happy. Oh, that's what she was doing, right? She just let us win. Crazy how he didn't even notice that before. Hello? Is she even finished? No. Oh my 
god. Hello? Fuck! I don't want that to be the way it ends. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. I feel like crying. I feel like sobbing. Oh my god, what a video game. So it was all in their head. And it was just a bunch of coincidences and weird things with false memories. I do want to know what what Louise was going through though, to have her be in that kind of mental state too. Oh my God. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God. My stomach hurts. My stomach hurts. My stomach hurts. I don't like that. I don't like that ending. <laughs> I want a happier ending. Why does she have to be abused and and die? Why did why does the why does it have to be both? Why can't it just be one? What a beautiful soul. My God, I don't even know how I can. I don't even know how I can move on from that. Like, God, oh, wow, what an amazing game, what an amazing experience. The humor was top notch. The characters were all enjoyable. The animation was so nice. It lagged it sometimes, but I'm pretty sure that was just because my PC's shit. And the whole thing about deja vu, I'm like, oh, is it, is it, is it, is it real? Is it, is there actually something paranormal going on, or is it just all in their head? And of course it was, of course it was all in their head. But what the fuck was the ruling? Why was there? I assume that was just all in people's heads too. It just so happened that there was just a bunch of natural disasters all at once, and people attributed it to like. Divine punishment, I guess. And and then what about that thing where the grandma was like, "This is your fault," and Sophia was like, "Yeah, it's my fault." How? What is? There's unanswered questions. Oh my god. I can't believe that, dude. I can't believe that. You know, it's always, um, it's always interesting to see when, um, child abuse is, is showcased in, um, in media, because, um, without getting into it, I am a, uh, I know about it <laughs> intimately, um, and the way Kathy acted and the way she just carried herself despite all of that is is uh is pretty accurate at least at least in my experience because i don't know you you don't get to be a child at home i guess so and you you only get to make people upset so uh when you're outside of that environment you only want you want to let it let loose you want to make people smile you want to have fun it's um you don't want to be a burden man
dance with you again. Continue. Uh, yes. <laughs>